Okay, so in this video, we'll be talking about higher order linear equation with constant coefficient. So in the previous video about the Wilshire equation, we have tackled how to get the general solution for linear equations of order 1. So meaning the highest order of, of the der derivative present of the differential equation is equal to 1. Now we'll go further, we'll go up and we'll be considering higher order linear equations but with a condition that those equations have constant coefficients okay so if we have a homogeneous so homogeneous uh, ODE so that is uh, uh, HODE that is the shortcut for higher order differential equation okay so if you have a homogeneous uh, homogeneous uh, linear higher order differential equation okay so the coefficients is constant the general formula for that one is a sub zero dny okay so our n is the uh, highest order derivative plus a1 okay this is n minus one of course this this will not be considered as an exponent but is, is considered as the um, order of the derivative okay plus so on and so forth plus a n minus 1 dy dx plus a n y is equal to 0 okay so this is the um, the general formula so if our first order derivative is our, our highest order derivative is 4 so this will be 4 here this will be 3 then we have 2 second order we have first order until and up, up until to the root um, equation or the root function so that is a to the n then y is equals to 0 so what makes this one is constant coefficient is the a here so they have the constant coefficients and they are then the left side of the equation is equal to zero so this is very important because if our given equation will be like this we could we could apply the method of auxiliary equation okay so we could transform our differential equation into an auxiliary equation auxiliary equation okay so what is an auxiliary equation so our given ODE here this one our given derivative the dy dx or the y prime or x uh, dx dt whatever the given derivative we will have our dy dx or we have here could have this also as y prime equal to d so that is the so-called this is the so-called d operator okay so if we have second order derivative so this y double prime so this will be d squared and if that will be third order okay third order okay so this will be third order also okay so for example here we have a differential equation a higher order differential equation Okay, so we just find some example like for example this one we have third order derivative of y in terms of x uh, minus 4 second derivative of y in terms of x plus dy dx plus 6y is equals to 0 okay so we could write this one as one uh, y triple y y minus 4 y double prime plus y prime plus 6y is equal to 0 so using the d operator so we could write this one also d cube minus 4 d squared plus d plus 6 y is equals to 0 now if we will um, 
get the auxiliary equation of this one. So let's uh, say that d y is equal to m. So we could write this one as m cubed minus 4 m squared plus m plus 6 is equal to 0. And this is now our auxiliary equation. And if you are going to get the roots of this um, fun of this auxiliary equation, we could now get the general solution of our higher order linear equation with constant coefficient. So there are four types of um, roots for this one. We have the distinct um, real roots, the repeated real roots, the distinct imaginary, and the uh, repeated imaginary roots. So we will discuss those types of roots and we will try to get the um, general solution for the corresponding HODE of those auxiliary equation. Okay, so I hope you learned something from this video and as always enjoy learning.